Hello everybody out here on YouTube. It is I Here with Beautiful Beauty. Going to be talking today about a shampoo bar. Um, you guys know I love shampoo bars. I've been totally addicted to shampoo bars for, oh man, six years, seven years, <laughs> like a lifetime literally. Anyhow, I've tried some really great, I've bought some really great shampoo bars over the years and I have bought some really not so good shampoo bars as well. Um, shampoo bars are a little bit more difficult to differentiate uh, well um, than liquid shampoo basically is what I'm trying to say. It's harder to find a good shampoo bar than it is to find a good liquid shampoo in a plastic bottle. Okay, basically that's what I'm saying. So, this is some good stuff though. This is my second bar of this. And it seems like when I bought it, the name of it was like yoga something. But I'm like looking at the box and I really don't see, does it say yoga somewhere on there? Anyhow, like the brand is yoga something or another. Um, anyhow, I will link it up the down bar below, but it is unfragranced, it is unscented, it doesn't have a smell to it. I absolutely love it. It leaves your hair feeling clean, uh, but yet it doesn't leave the residual buildup that other shampoo bars do. It cleans your hair thoroughly, it leaves it clean feeling, it leaves it hydrated feeling, it doesn't strip it out like straw. And it doesn't leave that nasty residual residue buildup. I know I've said that like three times already, but you guys know what I'm talking about. Some shampoo bars are worse at edit than others, you know what I mean? So I don't really get the residual buildup feel with this, so I absolutely love it. Anyhow, and also my sinuses are killing me, you guys. Literally, it's like middle of summer, and I am so... <laughs> I don't know. But anyhow, once you see the ingredients and all that, what it says, this is the box, then I'm going to show you the bar. This is the second one I used. Okay, it says, for sensitive skin and all hair types, pure, unscented, and obviously shampooing directions. So that's like, if you are unfamiliar with using shampoo bars, if you're new to it, Basically, you, you can either rub it with the bar between your hands and then apply it with your hands, or you can just take the bar and rub the bar starting at the roots down to the tips of the hair. Um, you know, some people say that's kind of rough for the hair. Honestly, it doesn't, it, it doesn't do any damage whatsoever to my hair. I'm a licensed cosmetologist. I'm a hairstylist. I have three professional level jobs. That so happens to be one of them. And when I take the bar and just rub the bar, starting from my roots down to the tips of my hair, it doesn't damage the cuticle or the cortex of the hair whatsoever for me. But if you do have super fragile hair, um, just start out rubbing it between the palms of your hand and just apply the shampoo bar just the shampoo with your hands you know what I mean and sometimes it takes up a little effort to work up the lather you know to do it that way so for me I just sometimes I just won't wait you know and I just I, I rub it through my hair my hair does good like that but anyhow uh, okay there's the ingredients it has really nice clean ingredients and so it says cruelty free which I absolutely love that let me show you I open the box from the bottom I'm going to show you what the bar looks like. Literally, I think my house is a mess today. Today's like house cleaning day, you guys. And do you do you have to make like a bigger mess of your house to clean your house? <laughs> I do. <laughs> oh, I so hate that. But um, like other parts of my house are totally clean now and other parts are dirty. So it's like some of the rooms end up dirty while I get some of the rooms clean. It's just totally ridiculous. It is what it is. Anyhow, it looks like there's a card in there. Okay, so, but anyhow, this is what the bar looks like. It's a real basic looking bar. Good stuff. It's not a super big bar. I'd say that's probably one point. Um, that's not a two ounce bar. I'd say it's probably one point something ounce bar. If you could see what it looks like in my hand. It's not huge, it's not tiny, small, neither. But anyhow, I love this stuff. And I will also like to say, if you are new to using a shampoo bars, be sure to keep your shampoo bar completely dry between usages. 
don't just leave it in your shower and let it become all sludgy and, and smushy and smashy and nasty because that's just not the way they work. They, they don't work efficiently that way. So after you take your shower, leave it in an area where it could properly air dry and then you could store it in a, you know, plastic soap dish, a tin jar, a glass jar, whatever, and then you can, you know, <clears throat> pack it away, but just make sure it dries itself out. So this is a good formulation. Very pleased to have come across this. It seems like it was kind of pricey, you know what I mean? Because like I said, the bars, you know, fairly small, so it seemed pricey. Um, but yeah, you know, and also I, wa I wanted to say if you are new to shampoo bars from like losing... I'm dropping something. If you're new to using shampoo bars from using liquid shampoo, um, you might want to follow up with an apple cider vinegar rinse after you use the shampoo bar. And I am on the floor trying to figure out what I dropped. But anyhow, if you want to do an ACV rinse and you're brand new to shampoo bars, and that will help transition your hair over because definitely when you jump from basic liquid shampoo and you jump over to using can, you know, these uh, heavier, they're conditioner-like shampoo-type bars, <clears throat> you might need to do an ACV rinse. Anyhow, I don't want to make the video too darn long. You guys know I've been, I've been playing this shampoo bar drum for a long time. I really do love shampoo bars. It's like once I get back into the swing of using them, then I don't even want to go back to liquid. You know what I mean? Because it's so quick, it's so convenient, it's so easy. And it does my hair just as good as other liquid shampoos. It's like, it, it's a nice, it's a nice, easy rhythm to get into. And I love it. I love you guys. Take care. Bye, beautiful.